There's nothing Bob Jennings loves more than helping someone improve. Seeing a change, guiding them to do better than they ever thought they could. It's the key to great coaching. It's why he became one. And it's why what he's decided to do may take you by surprise. I have been coaching now for 49 and a half years. I'm retiring at the end of this month. It'll be bittersweet, but it's time for new people. They'll take over, they'll come up with new ideas, they'll have new enthusiasm. So that'll be very good for the team also. It's just, it's time for a change. And I'll miss it, but that's the way it goes. But Jennings retiring? That's going to take a while to get used to. He's been the coach of the Village's aquatic swim team for almost a decade and helped them grow into one of the most dominant clubs around. The Village's is an athlete's heaven. We have a running club, we have a triathlon club, biking clubs, we have a swim team. We have about 100 on the swim team. We are very close. I love the competition, but I like love working out and being around the other swimmers more than anything else. And the athletes in the villages are just inspiring. There's always somebody much better than you and just makes you work harder. Jennings says working harder is what leads to success, a belief he's been sharing for a long time. I started coaching in high school, various sports, and I love coaching. So that just led me into teaching. I coached swimming high school for 36 years and soccer high school for 11 years. The best teachers are the ones who continue to learn themselves. Jennings says he's learned that there's a big, undeniable difference when it comes to coaching between older adults and kids. A lot of kids, they do, they swim, they do whatever sport because their parents tell them. These are adults that want to be there. They're there on their own and that makes it more fun. I mean, I don't care if they're a superstar or the slowest in the pool. They're in there trying, and that's all that ever counts with anything in athletics, but especially in swimming. And that's why Jennings is leaving. He feels it's time to move on, to turn the team over to new voices. He's ready to find his what's next in his own life. He wants to see what can happen when he focuses on himself, his family, and his own swimming. He's 68 now, and over the last 14 years, he's won his share of medals, but he's ready for more. Swimming has taken him to eight countries. Will there be more? For now, Jennings has his sights set on the National Senior Games. And beyond that... I will be swimming. I have a half marathon in January. We have the Village Games for swimming. I'll be doing the same things, just a little bit more time at home and spending more time with my wife and my family. And as for the team, well, they'll miss far more than just a coach because Jennings realizes something simple yet profound, that sports are just like life. As important as knowledge, what we really need is inspiration. People always think of coaching as just X's and O's, but it's so much more than that. If you're taking care of people, helping with stroke mechanics, listening to some of the older swimmers, being organized, being able to get them ready for their meets is so important. And understanding that there's other things in life also. You're helping other people and you try to inspire them with your love of what you're doing in the sport and in coaching. And what we get from swimming, your heart's stronger, the bonds with people, we take care of each other, you're healthier. You just can't beat that.